making the pirate ships for Pirate of the Caribbean was a, a very fun project. I mean, we have fun projects for sure, but it was a ultra for me, a real fun project. Uh, you know, you as a kid or a lot of people uh, made pirate ships uh, long ago. You know, you have a kit, you know, or start like thing like that. Or even earlier, you just take a, a two by four, cut the corners thing and then put a uh, dowel in it and put a little paper sail and watch it go in a mud puddle. It, it's hard for some people to believe that some of those boats were really big. I mean, we would do uh, a 20-foot long boat, and uh, there was a deck that was even bigger than that, which the mast was like that round. And, but it, it was a model, you know, uh, for the big explosions. You need to make things bigger for explosions. By that time, we had a very large laser cutter, about 4 by 8 could cut 4 by 8 uh, sheets of plywood. So we could make that pirate ship any size we want to, which was kind of interesting. The director you know, could come in and say, you know, we'd, we'd actually make, uh, as if looking like a skeleton of a pirate ship with masts and everything like that. It was like a, putting a kit together because it was all in the computer and then we could have it cut the wood out any time and you put A to B and B to C and all that stuff. And so you could come up with kind of a transparent ghost ship this big or this big or that big. What do you want, you know? 